What is going on guys? Fremracer24 here, back on the channel, finally for some more Forza Horizon 3. And you can see in the background, I finally got uh, Blizzard Mountain. Well, not finally, I've kind of had it, i just been putting it off for a while. Uh, I played it here and there, um, and it's pretty fun, uh, I, I gotta say. But anyways, I know, and I know I'm late, like as shit, with uh, these videos, but... Uh, well, with this video in particular, I kind of wanted to do this a while back, just Christmas got in the way, and, you know, cool stuff. Um, anyways, what I want to do today for this video is basically do kind of like a review, sort of, on how far they've come with the wheel. Because I know you guys like to know my settings and stuff like that, and I have got them down packed. Basically ever since they've came to let's see what version I don't even know what version this is I think it's like uh, like 1 point something point three five or something like that maybe even better than that I'm not sure but uh, I've missed a lot of DLC packs that came out like I think like two came out or maybe it's just one um, I'm not actually sure let me go ahead even though it says these aren't purchased um, Oh yeah, this came out. When how, when did this come out? I think this came out not too long ago. Yeah, and this is the car I'm driving, so I want to actually get in that, but that'll be later. Jaguar Bentley. That thing looks beautiful. So yeah, let me just make sure, because I think that was the latest one. Yeah, I don't know. Fucking, you never know with these things. Um, you have to check the Forza after that. Anyways, I want to just drive around for a moment and let me show you I'm gonna have let's just okay let me start off clean here I'm all over the place already so basically uh, it's been like three months maybe four I can't I, I can't even count how many months it's been since uh, since this game came out and when and where the the wheel came from you know from then to now has like been absolutely like amazing and I hope I'm getting good frames. It doesn't seem like it. I don't know. I got a new monitor, so that's pretty cool. Also, I'm using a, a new recording software. I'm using OBS now, and hopefully the wheel isn't too loud. But uh, let me just go over here. Oh, yep, I am using a two-wheel drive in the snow because, you know, YOLO or whatever the kids say say these days. Okay, yeah, this is where I want. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, here we go. Get a nice smooth piece of ice over here. Oh, man. It's the coolest thing they could have done with a video game. Just add fucking snow blizzards and, you know, non-stop blizzard mountain. Like, there's only one season in this world. And then a, an, an iced over lake that will never break. Even though that'd be cool if it did break, you know, depending on how, how heavy or whatever you're doing. Like, if you were doing, like, a burnout or something, like, over this part, it's going to fucking wear down the ice. Oops. It's going to wear down the ice, definitely. And I need to... That's one thing we're going to talk about once I get into this, is this does not save. I have to go in every time and save it. It doesn't remember. See? Now I can look left. But yeah, you would definitely just dig a hole right into the bottom of this. Well, of course, if you're stationary, obviously I'm moving, but whatever. You get, you get the point. Damn, that looks so fucking cool. Look, it's still red hot. I'm not even hitting the brakes. wonder why that is. I guess it's just going to stay fucking red hot here not even melt the snow oh there it goes it's going down okay anyways let's get into this video um what i wanted to talk about like i said was how far the wheel has come now i'm going to show you guys my settings and i mean the wheel is phenomenal i actually went on here to get to like do a video like uh the other day and i was blown away it was like the first time i came back and like a like ever since i kind of missed an entire update I missed a lot actually, um, but uh, we're back and we're good, but let me just, if I can, how do I, 
How do we get advanced? Here we go. Uh, they changed the settings for going into advanced. I don't remember it hitting this button at least. But anyways, here are my settings. Everything from like e-brake, this one up. I keep it default. So whatever you saw, uh, it should be the default unless I'm an idiot and just change some of it by accident. Um, but yeah, vibration scale, I could actually probably even bring that down some because it does get vibrating a lot in the snow, depending on what car you're driving, of course. Um, you know, when I'm driving this AMG, this thing, or whatever it's called, this thing is, you know, you're, you might have, I guess in real life, some vibrations, you know, if you think about it. I don't know. Uh, understeer 100% because that's for when you're drifting, you want all the feedback to help you so you don't have to, because in real life, when you turn left and then come back come back right it's gonna it's gonna come back left because the car is gonna try and straighten out that's just how friction works so that's basically what that's doing is you know you, you want all the feedback in the world for your understeer to correct itself um, so yeah have that on 100 this feedback scale this can get, be from you know wherever you want it to be uh, even 50 I think the defaults like 50 I'm not sure but I just brought mine up. I could probably bring it down. I'm going to try to bring it down just a tad today. Um, minimum force 100. Just keep that at 100. You want all the feedback. Uh, unless you know you, you don't really care for that much feedback, bring that down. Um, all this stuff off, especially this one right here. Keep that off. Don't know why that's a feature. Uh, let's see. That's basically it. I keep this on just to use the mouse whenever I want a free look. Uh, I think it kind of messes up the map though, because I have to use the mouse in order to use. I'm not sure um, because I can't. I used to be able to use the D-pad to look through the map, and it uh, doesn't. It doesn't quite work anymore, unless they fix that since I've been gone. Um, let's see. Wheel damper scale zero. This honestly, I haven't messed with this ever since they've made the wheel ten times better in the past month. So. If you want to try and mess with that, do it, but I'm probably going to later, so don't worry about it if you don't want to, if you don't care. And then sensitivity at 50. I'm pretty sure I used to have that at 20. Yeah, I used to have it at like 21, 22, maybe 23, in between there. And um, you can basically have that between 50 and 100 now. It, it, the default is good. So yeah, just these are base. These are my settings. These are the base, basic settings that I prefer, and I mean they're 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 amazing. So uh, besides, you know, when you when it comes down to the G27, I've said this in previous videos, the the vibration is pretty bad on this on this model of wheel, but um, you know the ice isn't that good of a representation for this wheel so for any wheel for that matter because it's just too slippery you don't get any feedback um, probably the snow is too but I don't know we're just gonna try it out but um, the vibration has always been bad for some people some people they get good good wheels I don't know if it's just an all I've heard some people on the internet say their G27 is perfect like the vibration is not loud at all and and whatnot but uh, we're going to stick with this car for now just because we have it and we're far from home. And it's fucking fast. It's so fast. Oof. She's actually wanting to grip up for some reason. Oh, shit. Going uphill. Here we go. I've actually never been this way. I've actually never been up the hill. As you can see, you can see the map. All the, gr all the roads are gray. So this is all new to me. So that's kind of cool, to be honest. But we're just going to play around, let you have a feel. Um, you know, if you you probably like exited out of the video by now. You just want the settings, and you're good. But um, we're just going to play it cool up these mountains. Have a little, a little landslide once or twice. Landslide, I don't know what I'm talking about. Maybe, uh, oh, have not tuned this car at all. Excuse me. Sorry, sorry, yep. Oh, yeah. But, yeah, um, I am using OBS now, so I'm not using NVIDIA Shadowplay anymore. That that 
that program is just garbage compared to even DX Story, and I can't use DX Story anymore because the file size gets up to like 200 gigs of video, depending on. I mean, unedited, of course. The raw video is it's lossless. The codec is just terrible. If you don't know what I'm talking about, don't worry about it. It's just bullshit, video recording bullshit. That if you want to be a YouTuber, any type of YouTuber. I don't know why I call myself a YouTuber. I'm not that big of a YouTuber at all. But if you want to make videos, let's just say that. Uh, we just had a pilot. You uh, do not want 200 gigabyte videos as your raw video. Because that literally takes up a quarter of whatever hard drive you have. Especially if you're like me and only have like 2 terabytes. Can't afford that fucking 4 terabyte bullshit. Ow. So I believe you can go all the way up on the top of that mountain. But I don't know. I literally haven't seen any other videos on this. Oh, don't hit the wall. But yeah, I mean, the wheel is beautiful now. I think I might change out my clutch for the e-brake and just use the clutch on my on this on my pedals as the e-brake. Just because I do generally like drifting in this game a lot. It's basically like half the thing half the way I drive around this place is drifting especially in Blizzard Mountain. Oh, excuse me. Was that a Charger? That thing, nice. Okay, yeah, I want to get a, a different car now, so we're going to go ahead and change up, and I'll be right back. So, I just noticed that I didn't have my light on. I don't think I did, at least, for the uh, for the wheel cam here, but hopefully you saw some of it. Um, I'm pretty sure you did. So, anyways, uh, I got this Titan out. This thing is a freaking beast, and I don't know if you can tell, but... Those tires in the back are so damn thick, it's not even funny. And I kept the default rims. You know, I didn't, I, I don't know if it's new, but uh, I think you can actually make the default rims. Like, all right, well, I know you can. You can make them bigger now. I don't think you could have done that, like, before. So, so that's pretty cool. I, uh, I didn't get the biggest turbo on it because that was 420 horsepower or more. So I just got the other one, which was 250, and then I maxed it all out. Uh, so, oh my god, because this thing, wait, is this thing front wheel drive? No way, this thing is not front wheel drive. Yeah, it's definitely, that is front wheel drive. Oh my god, that thing's groove music. Nah, this thing isn't front wheel drive, can't be. That's scary if it is. Because this thing, its stock was terribly slow, and I didn't change the, the uh, whatchamacallit, drivetrain, so. But yeah, for this car, I'm going to definitely drive a little bit faster, just to give you like an idea of how the, um, how the wheel reacts now. Because, I mean, it's a shit ton better. I mean, it's so loose on the, on the ice, it just feels like it should, you know. So, and we're going to go to the top of this mountain here. Because I feel like it, and I haven't yet. Oh god! Oh, she's almost struggling. I took 1,600. Holy shit! It's like 1,600 pounds off this thing. So oh yeah, let's get some cockpit action here. Oh. Oh, and I think I am... Oh, I stalled it. And I think I am... Oh, God. I think I'm running at 540, I believe. Because I'm kind of done with 720. It's either 540 or 900 for me from now on. Because, I don't know. I just don't think 720 was ac accurate. So, we're going to have to uh, stick with the whole 540 here. And it's 540 is just 10 times better for this game. Like, for iRacing, even for iRacing... Because most cars don't run 900 anyways, unless you're driving a fucking stock fucking Acura or something. Civic. Yeah, this thing is definitely front wheel drive. It's not even funny. Should have definitely, definitely fixed that up. Too bad. Too bad. So sad. It is stuck on the road, though. Jesus Christ. I, sh I probably should have got that big-ass turbo. 
Or probably would have been ideal. But oh man, we're getting some heavy fog here now. Yeah, front wheel drive is terrible. Oh my god. I can't even drift her. I think we're going this way though. Jesus, I can't see shite. I don't think Jesus could help me though. Take the wheel. Alright, hold on. I like this way. Even though I can't see it, it looks it feels good. I hear it calling to me. Oh, I see headlights in the distance. We're going down the dirt path here. Snow path, I should say. Jeez. How are you supposed to see anything? I got this bright ass light because I want to illuminate the wheel here. And I can't see shit. I just missed an EXP. Gotta get the EXP. Alright, we're going off. Oh my god. Oh fuck. Okay, so yeah, um. Ugh, that was crazy. Like I said, I haven't played much of this, so this is all, like, pretty new to me. Especially in a front wheel drive. Oh my god, that was like 20 minutes in the air. I'm literally just, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm winging it. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just going wherever. Looks like we got... Ooh, get it! Okay. Yep. Oh god. I'm dead. Yep. That's death. That's like head through the dashboard. I've got speedometers going through my eyeballs. Okay, that's a bit too much. So. Damn. I do like the look of this new Titan. Man. I don't have any more. Oh, yeah, I got more gears, too. Can't even use them, barely. So, yeah, guys. Uh, basically, all I really wanted to do for this video, because the wheel has... It blew me away when I came back on it. I missed, like, at least two or three updates. I don't know. Maybe they skipped just a bunch of numbers, and it was only one or something. I don't know. I didn't look too much in the patch notes. But they have fixed a great deal for us PC players. They also came out with a demo, so if you don't even have this game, you can try it out. Did I say Anna? I didn't say Anna, did I? I probably said it like mid sense. But anyways, oh god, oh god. Um, but yeah, go try that demo if you haven't got the game. The game is awesome. Um, no, no thanks. Anyways, uh... Let's go up this way. I haven't been this way yet. Ooh, looks promising. Sorry, sign. But, uh, yeah, basically all I wanted to do. Um, hope you guys did enjoy. The wheel is phenomenal. Uh, check my settings out and uh, try them out. Let me know how they are. Um, I'll have screenshots uh, down below, too, in the description as well. If you didn't catch it or if you don't feel like going back. Um... So I'm a nice guy, and I, you know, I like helping others, especially when, I mean, even the default settings I think are better now. I haven't actually reverted all the way back to default, but they should, I don't know, just like, by, you know, how much they've fixed it already, I just really think the default should be good, but I definitely had to change my sensitivity from 20, because it was just like not needed anymore. It was just terrible. I'm gonna have to turn Anna off. You are crazy, ma'am. But alright guys, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'm trying to put out more videos. It seems that I have a lot more time now. Now that uh, Christmas is coming to a close. And uh, let me know what you guys got for Christmas. I wanna know, cause I got, you know, like nothing really. I got like a video game and a shirt. And, uh, and, uh, yeah. Let me know.
Oh wow, we just barely almost not died. Alright guys, take it easy. I'll see you guys in the next video. Oh shit.